So today, I wanted to kind of catch up. It's been pretty busy here in the old boat shop over the last couple of days. We finished up the planking, as I was talking about in our last, last time, and then we started working on the outer stems and the outer keel structure. And uh, just <clears throat> this morning, removed the screws that I had holding everything in place while it was epoxied. Had to use heat on the screwdriver. Another tip I got from uh, the Off Center Harbor videos. And if it hadn't been for that, I probably wouldn't have got the screws out. They were epoxied in there pretty good. But you can see down the boat, got her keel is in place. Front stem, I started trying to get a fair curve out of it. I still got quite a bit of work to do there. <clears throat> and then the transition from the keel to the back stem. Now these stems are also tapered in this axis. As you can see, it's one and three quarter at the bottom and tapers up to seven eighths. And the water line's kind of in this area, so right in here I transitioned from seven eighths to inch and a quarter. So the gudgeons that I need to hold the rudder blade on will fit because the gudgeons are these. And they are inch and a quarter wide. So see that kind of fits nicely. So now we just have to finish sand the entire boat and fill in some of the places where, you know, the, uh, the, uh, needs a little body work to smooth things up, fill those in, sand those, get the whole thing prepared and ready and give it a couple of coats of epoxy and be ready to turn the boat over. Kind of an exciting time. 